Hey guys, just wanted to post this drill. So essentially what you're doing is you're gonna index with your, your front hand. Usually everyone's right-handed, so their front hand's gonna be their left hand here. And your partner's gonna hold a pad and the partner's gonna apply some pressure. So that way you're kind of holding the person up, but not so much pressure where your structure kind of collapses. But you're holding them up and you're tracking where the pad goes and this one's, your right hand's locked and loaded, right? It's kind of like a piston. So when you feel the opportunity for you to shoot, you're gonna shoot that piston out, bring it right back. This one can let go for a split second as you shoot it out. Um, or you could just keep it there and just and, and hold the person away as you do that. You throw multiple shots, but this is really just so you maintain your balance as you're moving around. You're not overcompensating by pushing in and, and leaning forward. And it allows you to strike off of a frame. So check it out. So you guys see here, I'm keeping the pad very static and it's really just a little bit pressure forward. And then as the drill gets a little more complicated, I start like moving the pad around, kind of like making circles with my hand, making uh, the person here track the pad. That way they're working on footwork, they're working on distance management and that hand is always locked and loaded. One last thing to consider as a person doing the punching, you want to try to follow into the strike. So you, won't, you don't want to feel like you're falling backwards as you strike. So even if you need to take a step forward during the strike, that's more beneficial. That way you're thinking about following through to your next shot. 